Active Planner Autodesk Developers so the BIM models can be integrated with all the rich asset data. In this case, Origin Housing commissioned PRP to produce a safety case for this development which is wrapped around Watford Football Stadium. PRP took a point cloud into Revit and uploaded this BIM model into Origin's Active Plan platform, where the model and all the assets they recorded in the safety case survey are integrated. Some people want to view that in the model and see the information PRP has authored about the external cladding and the balconies. The user can navigate freely or pick from a menu of saved views that take them directly to an area. We can click on the door and see the asset data that's managed in Origin's asset information platform. The important thing here is that the initial survey records a door type with glazing panels, but it may require another visit by an expert to determine its fire performance. ActivePlan supports that sort of incremental process, adding information to assets as it becomes available. The fire door expert may use their own mobile software like Plan Radar, Bolster or Vision in which case that data can sync with the active plan object. If the manufacturer's detailed information were in the product library, that would be connected as well. This means that the data is created and managed by the suppliers. Lloyd's Register is now using the product library to verify that data has actually come from that manufacturer. The complex data required to calculate embodied carbon is easily added and can be updated as we learn more about that growing need to reach zero all part of the golden thread. Any survey or inspection details can be either stored here as documents or we could connect directly to other applications through web services or URLs. Asset managers may prefer a 2D plan so one click opens up an interactive plan which shows the asset and also highlights the spaces it's protecting. We can click on the space and see all of the other assets that support that space PRP's safety case survey was really comprehensive and identified over 5,000 assets and where they are in the building. So we can click on the space and see all of the other assets that support that space. A single click on dry risers shows us exactly where they are on each floor. The asset manager might want to know where the other key assets are, perhaps smoke vents or dampers, so ActivePlan provides them with a simple list so they can see where they are throughout the whole building. I guess this is the difference between compliance and the more holistic building safety information, considering how the spaces are being protected by several different assets and systems, all of which need to be 100% and working in concert to mitigate a hazard and keep people safe. The active plan presents us with that joined up view. Just get in touch so we can show you how you can activate your existing asset data and help demonstrate that the measures you have in place will keep residents safe.